Come on, we gotta get this. We gotta get this win. Got him. Counter. We gotta counter. I'm out of ammo. I'm out of ammo. Nice, give me your gun. Oh, 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 how did he not see me? Ha <laughs> ha! How did that noob not see me? Ha <laughs> ha! Are you serious? Wow, what a streak. You are now watching Chris Smooth do his thing on YouTube. It's only right that I attempt to get the first strike since I'm playing on the first strike map pack. Let's see if I can get the first blood. I get the first blood. Ooh, sniper says hello, Chris Smooth. How you doing? <laughs> oh, look at that. My teammates still secured B. So I did my job. I might have died, but I definitely contributed to getting that B flag. Uh oh. Uh oh, I see somebody up in the window. Ooh, he saw me too. Okay, let's try to go wide right. Wide right on him. Change up the angle. With the Super Bowl coming up, you never know who's going to go wide right. This is definitely my favorite class as far as perk setup. I got flak jacket, tactical mask. I try to come out in this kit pretty much every game, but depending on depending on what's happening in the game, I might not be able to stay with this kit. I might need I might need the cheese and go hard line with the spy plane and the and the counter, the low kill streak setup. I might need to rock ghost if the other team is getting spy planes every five seconds. Oh, look at that tactical insertion. Wow. Could you imagine what would have happened if I didn't see that tactical insertion? The owner of that tactical insertion would have gone to jail for raping our spawn. Like GFX Lab. Ha <laughs> ha. I got to do a song with GFX Lab or something in the summer. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha. Yeah. And I'm not going anywhere right now. I gotta, I gotta concentrate on this guy in that window. I know he's gonna pop back out. I don't care if you guys cry and complain about camping, and you guys call it camping, I call it winning. I'm winning right now. I'm holding it down. Look at that guy trying to take B. No way, I'm camping. I'm camping. You can't take B if I'm camping. I'm winning. I'm a winner. This is a winning maneuver. A smooth maneuver. What maneuver could possibly be smoother? Ah, I might be waiting here like most people. How long they wait to get a haircut at the barbershop. <laughs> I don't know. I never understood that. I always thought it was a smooth move the way how I get in and out of a barbershop. It's so funny. I walk into the barbershop on any given day and every time I go I think all right I'm gonna actually have to wait this time cuz when I go inside a barbershop there's usually a whole bunch of people in there there's a ton of people waiting for cuts and I'm like wow this is gonna be a wait it's gonna be a little bit of a wait but as soon as I'm about to sit down some barber says hey hey Chris come over here and that's because Everybody at the barbershop is waiting on that one guy to cut their hair. And I don't really understand that. I mean, I've been going to this barbershop for about since 1998. And I've pretty much got my hair cut. Ah, where'd this guy go? Come on, come on. Oh, he was in second chance. Wow, of course. I've pretty much got my hair cut by every single barber in that barbershop. And I have to say that they all cut exactly the same. I don't notice any differences at all. And I don't know, maybe I'm not a good example because because I get a simple cut. I just get a Caesar, same length all around. 
Nice little shape up. I'm not getting anything fancy. I'm not getting like a star design in my head, in my hair. I'm not getting like, I'm not getting anything fancy. I'm just getting a typical smooth haircut. So pretty much any barber can do that for me. But I don't know. I mean, I always thought it was a smooth move because one time, oh, oh, ho, ho. How dare you try to sneak up on me while I'm trying to tell a story? Come on, noob. You know that's not allowed. That's illegal. You can't sneak up on me. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was clutch. That was a clutch kill for my last kill streak. Don't you just. Don't you just feel that? Aw, oh, man. If this guy kills me, I'm gonna rage quit. Alright, good. I don't have to rage quit. I wouldn't have really rage quit, but. Dogs incoming. I don't know. This game, when you get close to those streaks, it, you just there's just this feeling you get. Oh, wait a second. How dare you shoot at me when I'm trying to tell a story? Come on now. Stop interrupting me. You guys should know this. You, sh you should know from Modern Warfare 2 abusing claimers. Don't interrupt me while I'm telling a story. I don't need. What was I even talking about? I don't even know. <laughs> wow, my dogs are tearing it up. Man's best friend. Or should I call him Smooth's best friend? Look at this. I'm getting a ton of kills. They definitely did something to the dogs after the patch. Because I remember before any patches, these dogs didn't get any kills. They would get like... I remember I used to call in dogs and they would literally get zero kills. I mean, that's just like... You get eleven. You get an 11 kill streak and you can't even get one kill with that thing. Oh, 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 oh. Get down to the ground with your second chance. Get down to the ground. Stop making noise. Stop making noise. Come on now. You know the rules. Come on. All you guys know the rules. Stop making noise. Oh. Okay. Ooh. 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 I'm tearing it up. Man, I'm tearing it up. I'm a beast. Ah. Of course that guy had to come from behind me. Okay. Time to hop in this chopper gunner. And I don't, at this point, I don't even care if people shoot me down because if I get a chopper gunner, that means that I was tearing it up down there. I was tearing it. Uh-oh. I'm hearing sounds already. Look at this. This is ridiculous. And... Uh, I shouldn't have... Ah, uh, I shouldn't have concentrated on that guy, that one lone guy. I should have looked for... Ah, uh, just waste. I could have gotten so many more kills. But I got that black bird for you. I got that smooth bird. Put that smooth bird in the sky. I'm not done with you noobs yet. <laughs> Seriously, I've gotten to the point where I don't even care if they shoot down my chopper gunners because that basically just means I was tearing it up down there. And if and if I and if I make them switch to Estrella and aim up in the sky, that means I did my job. That means I was running the show. Yo. Oh. Was that guy wearing ghost? I don't even know. It doesn't even matter because I had a blackbird up. And I let that guy... I let that guy own me. And now I know what I was talking I was talking about the barbershop. One time I went to the barbershop with a friend. We were both going to get some haircuts. So I was out of there in about 25 minutes. And I was like, I didn't feel like waiting. So I was like, alright, just meet me back at my house. So I go back to my house and my friend doesn't come back until about two hours and 30 minutes later. <laughs> that is not a smooth move at all. He must have been waiting. He must have been like all those other noobs waiting on that one barber. That's not going to do anything any different than any of the other barbers. I mean, I don't know. What do you guys think about that? When you guys go to the barbershop, do you have to get your hair cut by that specific barber? I mean, is it really worth the wait? Waiting, you know, two hours just to get a cut? Because I... I, I, I don't have time to waste. I don't want to be in a barbershop for two hours. I want to be in and out like a drive through <laughs> Wow, I think... I don't know. I think I like this map. My first impression just running around this map, I didn't... I thought it would be... You know, I thought it would take forever to discover an enemy on this map, but it seems pretty good. I don't know. I'm, I think I like this map. Not too bad. 
I don't know. What what kind of game do you think this was? Like a, a like a maybe like a 35 kill game, something like that. 46. Wow, I didn't even I wasn't even tempted to look at my score during the game. That's amazing. All right, let's get B. Let's get B. I'm taking B. Hop on B. Hop on B. Hop on B. I'm taking B. Okay, I got it by my lonely. Oh. Oh my goodness. Oh my. Oh. How. <laughs> how did he not. How did he not see me? <laughs> Zach Lava. What's up, boss? Thanks for the message. The music. I got a lot of music that needs to come out. Songs about gaming. Songs that have nothing to do with gaming. It could be a really, really smooth summer because I'm going to be off from school and work. So you know something's got to happen during that time for sure. What problems? What's up, boss? Thanks for the channel comment. It looks like I guessed correct when I said that waiters and waitresses make around two dollars an hour when they have to share their tips very interesting for sure and me when i'm in a restaurant i definitely leave smooth tips because i know that the tips is where the bulk of the money comes from so i definitely don't pull a hit and run when i go to a restaurant <laughs> paradise one what's up boss thanks for the tweet on twitter and i think everybody needs to thank you for this outro song I'm feeling so fly in my gun shit in my gun shit in my gun shit feeling so